Hello everyone, I am Satyajit and welcome back to my channel. We all know uh, this playlist is dedicated to learn Python from basics and uh, in this course we will learn everything you need to get started programming in Python. Now like we all know Python is a high level and a super productive language. When I say super productive, that means developers need not have to spend a lot of time in fixing issues. It's quite easy to learn as well. Apart from its benefits as a programming language, it's also used in analytics, data science and machine learning. And is on the top priority by the industry experts as compared to other languages. So let's go through our playlist to understand and learn Python from the basics. You can follow the playlist to get to know about the various topics which we shall be covering in this particular course. Now to get started and to learn about the course curriculum or the agenda which is already shown on the screen. If you are a beginner, don't worry as I will be holding your hands and help you learn Python from scratch. So this is going to be your agenda for this particular course. We will be starting from the basics of Python. We will start with installation of Python. What are variables, keywords, data types, what are various operators and operands in Python. In the next chapter, we'll talk about Python data structures, where we will talk about sets, lists, dictionaries, and tuples. After that, we'll move ahead to the Python loops, functions, and file handling. Inside that, we'll understand what are loops, comprehensions, functions, lambda functions, or what is map reduce and filter, file handling, and so on. In the next chapter, we will talk about Python exception handling. So we'll be learning what are the various exceptions that occur in Python programming, be it errors or exceptions and how to deal with them. In the next chapter, the chapter number five, we will talk about iterators and generators. And the very last topic will be Python for data science, which is one of the most important topics because our ultimate goal is to learn data science and enter the market, right? We should be more focusing on the Python for data science uh, chapter particularly. Obviously, we will be going through the basics of NumPy, Pandas and Matplotlib. But yeah, we do have some advanced courses or you can say advanced videos on these topics and the further libraries which shall be uploaded in the uh, uh, channel very soon. So introduction, Python, as I already talked about, it's an open source general purpose programming language. Obviously, it's object oriented programming as well as scripting language. Most of the industries right now are using Python. And of course, Python has a very good community as well. That is the reason why Python has grown like anything as compared to R programming. Because earlier, R programming was the only language which was being used in the analytics field. But now Python has come into the market and it's leading basically. Python is a general purpose programming language that is often applied in scripting roles. There are various features of Python over other languages. It's quite easy to learn and use. Writing a code in Java might take you seven to eight lines. The same thing is possible in just one or two lines in Python. So we'll talk about that slowly. It's an interpreted language. Open source, of course, it's freely available on the web. You can just download it and use it. Large standard library, large community support. Now that's what one of the most important features of Python is. You simply have any doubts, just Google it out. You will be able to find your solutions to the questions. So it has a very big community support. Obviously Stack Overflow and there are various other portals as well. Extensible and it's a cross platform language like used vividly. Yeah, again, this is one more slide explaining uh, the advantages of Python over other programming languages. It's more user friendly, more applications, stability, speed. So with respect to each of these points, Python has an upper edge as compared to the other programming languages. Okay, so that's it for today's video. And in the next video, we shall be starting with the basics of Python and slowly we will progress with the next topics. If you like the video, please like, share and subscribe the channel. Thank you.